This is a big game that I've been looking forward to for a really long time. I don't really know if I'm going to continuously stream it. It might be something that I stream here and there, but this is definitely something I'm going to be playing consistently. Hey, let's go. I'm really, 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 really excited for this game. So what you're trying to say is that you fell here from another world? But when you wanted to leave and go on to the next world... Oh. Your path was blocked by some unknown god? Oh shit, giving us plot right off the rip! Outlanders. You hear this music? Your journey ends here. Oh shit! That's the waifu, Who ladies and gentlemen! The sustainer of heavenly principles. The irrigation of mankind ends now. Whoa, what the fuck? We got the final boss fight? <laughs> Badass. <laughs> Holy shit, that's actually Bay. What the? F Yo, they literally just pulled the anime. They're like, all right, we're gonna go full anime weeb mode. Oh, you can select one. Oh shit, that's cool. Okay, uh, 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 I'm gonna pick the guy. Let's go. Okay, let's. What's my name gonna be? All right, well, that was easy. All right, let's go crow. Confirm. Oh snap, I just got some currency. Oh! Was that because I chose the boy? <laughs> oh no. God damn it. That shit's sick, bro. You hear this music, man? Uh oh. Wait, don't go. Give my sister back. Oh. And just like and that, just like oh. that, the god took away my sister. Some kind of seal was cast upon well, me. Well, pack it in, ladies and power. gentlemen. So while we used to travel from world to world, we are now trapped here. Yikes. Uh, I chose poorly, ladies and gentlemen. I wonder if- so if I had chose the girl, does that mean the boy would have gotten yoinked? That was anime as fuck, dude. Holy shit. That, the music was on point. The freaking action was on point. I'm excited. Okay, yeah, so if you pick the boy, How if you pick the girl, the boy- How many years ago was it? Alright. I don't know. Oh well, shit. I intend to find out. Meanwhile, when I woke, I was all alone until I met you 2 months ago. Mad yeah, wrong. Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon <laughs> likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. Okay. She got fished up. <laughs> we should head off. Let's get God, going. God, this is so anime. It's baffling. <laughs> oh shit. This is it. All right. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Genesis crystals. All right. So I did do like the online setup thing, like on the Genshin Impact website. So I, I think it gives me like a bunch of shit. All right. Obviously, jump with X, attack with circle. Oh, okay. 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 Sprinting is with uh, R1, and dodging is when you tap it. I guess. Okay. Yeah. So you tap the button to to dodge or to evade. And then you hold it to run. So there is a stamina system as well. Good old Breath of the Wild. Yeah. All right, so Circle's yeah. 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 basic combat right now. My character's name's Crow. Look at this guy. Stylish as fuck. He's got this long braided ponytail. I like his aesthetic. I like the way he looks. Rip our sister, by the way. We just like, we've, it's like, oh, you chose the boy. You've chosen death. Similar again to Breath of the Wild. There is a... Uh, Stamina meter, which uh, I am assuming I'm gonna just get really annoyed by as time goes on because at least for I do like the aesthetic of this world of the game though What there's stamina when you swim too? No, I'm gonna drown Get out get out get out don't drown You're in shallow water That's bullshit How are you gonna drown in shallow water my guy? Okay. Oh shoot little crab dude. Uh, a shelled creature that lives near the ocean. It's flaky, delicious, delicious meat can be easily cooked. All right, so 
we're eating shellfish, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, oh, combat! Yeah. Let's go! Oh, these look like the these look like the choo choos. Oh, how do I lock on? Is there a lock on button? I don't know if there's a lock on button, but we got our first our first kill, ladies and gentlemen. The path ends here. Guess we we'll just have to climb. Uh, Climbing depletes stamina, and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Ah, uh, come on. Which of the seven are you looking for exactly? Oh my god, look at this shit, dude. A lot of things I want to stop and take a look at. All right, what's this? Uh, calla lily, a flower that grows near water sources when cooked. The petals uh, have a crunchy texture. So there's a cooking system in the game. This game is free, by the way. If you are watching the stream and are wondering, hey, I'd like to play this game, this is free. An incredibly versatile ingredient that can apply to your daily protein. The one thing that I have to get used to is the, uh, the fact that you can't remap your buttons. I don't like how the attack button is circle, and I don't like how the sprint button is R1. Those are the two things right out the rip that I do not like. But, uh, you know, it's a free game. I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, look at that, man. Look at that. Look at that sweet view. <clears throat> Not Breath of the Wild. <coughs> uh, gotta do something about that cough. That's a statue of the Seven. There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show the Seven's protection over the world. Among the Seven Gods, this God controls the wind. Oh shoot, my boy Rivali. Paimon's not sure whether the God you're looking for is the Animal God, but Paimon will take you to the Animal God's place first, and there's a the reason why. Animo. Okay. The outlander who caught the wind. As we okay. all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. Oh, there's a treasure chest. I'm a fan. Gimme, gimme. -na 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 okay, never mind. That was pretty, pretty quick. Okay, we got some follow. We got some medicine potions, enhancement, or I don't know what any of this shit is right now. It's gonna take me a little while to figure out how this game actually works. I think there's like a crafting system and a bunch of other stuff in the game too. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. <laughs> you never know unless you try. Oh shoot! So let's hop to it! Berries. Small brightly colored fruit. They can be found everywhere in the taste. I didn't get to read all of that, but apparently it has a good taste. Right, the music is already on point i think the music's gonna be the best part of the game i don't really remember a lot of music during breath of the wild like traversing the world was very like there's a lot of dead noise oh all right hold on oh lizard bro the high tail lizard from breath of the okay i need to stop i need to stop i need to stop okay I need to stop comparing this to Breath of I'm, I'm probably going to annoy a lot of people if I constantly say that. It's just I can't help but see all, notice all of the similarities. All right, let's see. What is this thing? Hello? Mysterious beings called sea lie can be found scattered throughout Tevat. I guess that's the name of the world. If you follow them, the final destination, perhaps something special will happen. Uh, Koroks, I guess? Oh, is it going to lead me to this? Is that what it's leading me to? Yeah. Looks like it. <clears throat> Ooh! Exquisite chest, beginner protector, adventurer bandana, fine ore, adventurer, uh, adventurer's feather. All right, not bad, not bad. Oh! Hey! Shout out to your weapons not breaking. Iron chunk. I really hope they fix that in Breath of the Wild too, because I was not a fan. There were some weapons. Like the, the guardian weapons, I never used the guardian weapons because I was afraid of breaking them. And I know diamonds could fix them, but then I'd have to spend my diamonds, and I, I didn't want to do that either. Whoa, hold on, what was that? I just did like some dope ass move, hold on. It seems you've chosen death, squirrel. That move! Look at that! Oh wait, do you hold the button for it? Hold on. Yeah, holy shit. If you hold the button, it, like, so this is like your normal, like, tapping combo. This, if you hold it, it does like this dope ass move. That's sick. That's like your finisher. Oh, and the 
there's an air one too. If you hold it in the air, that's badass. That's, I like that. I like that, that's really cool. All right, here we go. You can swim right over. Okay. Let's hope I don't drown this time. Starfell Lake. Okay. Anything around here? Nothing? Okay. We good. <clears throat> oh. The god just blessed me. <clears throat> oh. Oh, okay, I get it. I like the names of these places. Cedar Lake, Stormbearer's Mountain, Star Snatch Cliff, Thousand Winds Temple, Whisper Whispering Woods. Ooh, did you just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of Animo. As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh-huh, it's because you're not from this world to begin with. Oh yeah, true. If we keep heading west, me and my here, sister were just we'll chilling. reach Mondstadt. Just traveling the, the world. Freedom. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of Animo. So perhaps because you got power from the god of Animo, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then. Right, the let's elements do it. in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Elemental skills. Whoa! Wind blade. Wait. Hold on. What the fuck did I just do? Hold on. Oh! Holy shit! Look at this! Wind blade. <laughs> Vaporized, my guy. <laughs> Elemental burst? What the fuck? Disappear! That's it. What? So the animal powers you got from the statue of the seven. Wait. So that oh, was a wind so ability. Jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting? That powers? hit a fire enemy and became a fire tornado. That shit's so sick. So what I want to know. Whoa. What the fuck is that thing? Yeah, what is that? There's something huge in the sky. There's a giant it's dragon, the heart bro. Of the we must proceed with caution. Oh, god damn. That's like a secret boss, isn't it? I do not want to follow wherever that dragon went, by the way. Like, no thank you. It did go over this, like, this cliff side on the other side, so I think I'm safe for now. All right, wish me luck, y'all. Oh, I wonder what happens if it's... Whoa, look at that! That's so cool! It just froze the water. That was an ice enemy, okay. That's kind of badass. Got a dull blade as well. All right, let's uh, let's look around. Oh, what are these? Dandelions. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wind. Hey, I did it. Like dandelions' best friend or is wind. All right, so is this like the equivalent of like a bokoblin stronghold? It kind of looks like it. I'm not that confident in combat, and that's exactly how it was for Breath of the Wild. I got my ass. I think in Breath of the Wild, I killed myself twice when I was trying to do combat. All right, let's go, let's go! Get him, get him! Oh, that's a... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa! Okay, hold on. All right, back up. There we go. Okay. Wait, is there another one? Okay, no, they're all... Okay, they're all dead. We did it! We did it, Reddit. My first bat... <laughs> My first battle wasn't the best. It was kind of sloppy, honestly. Ooh, radishes. I'll take that. Uh, rich in fiber and nutrients. Easy to grow and harvest. And we got a potato. Let's go. I didn't know my camera was in the game. All right, we'll take this as well. Open sesame. Well, that's a lot of stuff. All right, adventurous bandana, adventurous golden goblet. We got some experience. 
GG. But yeah, if any of you guys have this game, not sponsored by the way, but if any of you guys have this game, it is on PS4, PC, and mobile. And it is free to download and play. Like you can literally just play it like I'm doing right now. Um, it is, uh, it does have gotcha elements. So there are like microtransactions and stuff like that. But based on like how I'm playing, it doesn't seem at all that like I need any of that shit. I guess it's if you want it, you can go for it, but you don't need to. Oh, shoot. They got me cornered. Oh, that guy. These guys remind me of the, the choo-choos. Oh, we get a chest from that too, nice. They remind me of the choo-choos from Breath of the Wild. Oh, is that a new weapon? That looks like a great sword. Only swords. Ah, oh, that's lame. I better get some new party members relatively soon then. Yeah, weapons are character specific. Huh? Look at that. Oh, is that the giant fucking dragon that I didn't want to come to, but I'm Whoa! Don't be afraid. What are you a summoner? It's all right now. I'm back. I'm back. Is he talking to a dragon? Uh oh. Oh no! Don't eat him! Jesus. Who's this kid? Please don't tell me I have to fight this dragon right now. I'm not ready. Whoa! What the fuck? This kid just disappeared! Hey, who's ready for a boss fight? Not me. Okay, never. Thank fucking God. <laughs> I was not ready for that. That was close. Who was that? Paimon almost got blown away. Luckily, Paimon managed to grab hold of your hair. Why are you speaking in the third person? Just what was that? Paimon thought we were gonna get eaten. True. No clue. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the That's dragon. That's not nice. Why call him a weirdo? He's talking to dragons normal. I can't believe dragons exist in this world. Oh, I mean, we're not from this world, so who are we to say, oh, I can't believe, you know what I mean? Is talking to dragons normal? <sighs> of course not. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. Oh, boy. Let's go take a closer look. Uh, d do we have to? Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. So why are you going to investigate the thing if you don't have, if okay. Hey, let's go investigate this thing. By the way, I don't have a good feeling about this. It's like, oh, okay. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Put it away? Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. What? What? How is that your definition of putting it away? Taking something that you're cautious about does not mean putting it away. <laughs> Hello? Alright. Paimon's not the, uh... Paimon's not the, the sharpest crayon in the box, I don't think, guys. I'm pretty <laughs> sure... Pretty sure that's what the game's trying to relay to us right now. It's dangerous to take this, go alone. <laughs> Yo, Paimon, you're looking pretty sus right now, I'm just saying. I have no idea what any of this stuff is, but I'd rather, like, over-prepare. I'd rather just get all this stuff, because I don't really know what the value of anything in this game is just yet. That, oh, we got some more enemies over here. All right, wish me luck. How do I get this guy up here? Oh, shit. This guy, how do I get this guy up here? Nani? Hold on, maybe, maybe this? Oh, that worked, nice. Holy shit, I actually, like, eviscerated that guy. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, I had to use my, like, super secret, like, mega move, but we got him. Pine cones. Dude, I really just want to go all the way up there to, like, the peak of that, like, ridge. Like, at the very top back there. I feel like I could. I still have to get back to Breath of the Wild. I never even... I mean, I finished the base game, but I wanted to do all the shrines. I wanted to get the Tunic of the Wild. I still have to do the DLC. The Ooh, hey. We have another N N uh, uh, an NPC. All right, hold on. I'm over here, like, grabbing all my food. 
Oh, she's a cook. I I'm gonna go for the steak, actually. Uh, let's cook. Oh, wait, what? Oh, what? I participated in the cooking? That's cool. Hold on, I'm about to do that again. I can probably get proficiency five. That's actually, I like this. It's better than just like throwing it all in a dish, having a little jingle, and then it's done for you. I actually like that. All right, let's try this again. Dude, I'm getting proficiency five right now with this steak, my guy. Let's go. GG. I would, this is the mini game I was born for, ladies and gentlemen. Nice, proficiency five. Automatic cooking. Oh, so when you get max proficiency, then you can automatically cook it. I do like that though. Like, so we have wind abilities. So I wonder if we'll get enemies like with electric abilities that will then interact with water enemies or water environments. Like we saw that one ice enemy that um, like when we, when we killed it, it burst and it froze the lake. So ice interacting with water, fire interacting with wind electricity interacting with water i i think that's really fun for the for the elemental aspect of of combat for sure all right this is the waypoint okay here we go <clears throat> hey you stop right there nani oh the girl it's like the mascot of the game oh is that the one with the treasure she's like hey you stole my treasure may the animo god protect you stranger greetings I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Um, my sister got kidnapped by this, like, a waifu god. We're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. It's like, you're not looking for trouble? Good, because I am. <laughs> Doesn't sound like a local name to me. A local name? It's a name, though. And this mascot what's the deal with it we're friends emergency food <laughs> i'm keeping her around in case i get hungry i mean we've only been traveling partners for two that's months that's funny but i like amber she looks really really awesome we've already become the very best of friends so to sum it up you're traveling partners right hmm well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. <clears throat> Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, thank you. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I assume she's fire-based just based on the fact that she's wearing red all over. I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Hey, I, I we could take care of ourselves, lady. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, Why uh, so suspicious? I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, <laughs> strange yet respectable travelers. I like her. It's so fake. Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Kind of. Kinda. Not gonna lie. Leave it to me. Yo, is she in our party? What? We can switch. Obtained Amber, always energetic and full of life. Amber's the best. Oh my god. And she's got a bow! Okay. Best character automatically. So, suspicious travelers, what are what? you doing in Monster? <laughs> what is that? He got separated from his is that a decoy? A really, really long journey. <laughs> Is buddy, helping him to find his That's so cool, oh, dude. Good for your family. What? Oh, yeah. just... Already my favorite. Already my favorite. Okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. Holy shit, I love her what already. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? She's got a dive attack it's too. Simple. You'll understand in a bit. Combat. Oh my god, this is awesome. Placing elemental skills. Some elementals produce different effects depending on whether you press or hold them. So I don't know which one I did. Did I press? Oh, so if I... Yeah, <laughs> she can just yeet it, dude. <laughs> she just fucking yeets her thing. Like, yeet! Go, go, Baron Bunny. Baron Bunny. That's so cute. Oh, my God. Already favorite character. Calling it right now. Pack it in. No one else matters. Amber's best girl automatically 
Oh, we got a silver sword for my for my guy. Holy shit, dude. They just dropped like a really great character on us out of out of nowhere, bro. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey! Yeah! Yeet! <laughs> oh, look at look at this! Hey! Don't look over here, buddy. You idiot. <laughs> These monsters have been getting too close to the city recently. Nice. My task this time is to clear out their camp. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Okay, so I guess this is why I came I came here way too early then. So what I'm wondering now is uh Oh, what the fuck? That's the guy with the with the giant sword. He's also fire, I think. Pyro attacks can cause beings to become affected by pyro when pyro meets another element, it often triggers an elemental reaction. Okay, so what I was going to say was if I throw if I throw this, right? And let's just say it does explode. Right? So hold on, let me let me do one of this real quick. Let me hit that guy. All right, so these guys are fire. How do I Okay, and then I switch. This is really like core. So, I can activate one element, switch to another character and create an elemental reaction. It's just like I need to I need to I need to figure out uh I need to be quicker about it. I I'm still like learning the the like the control schemes and everything. Aiming shots are great for making precision attacks on enemies weak point weak points tips. Most humanoids aim for the head. Okay. All right. Boom. There you go. Sweet. Huh, nothing to it. Though I've got to say, you surprised me a little with your moves there. Thanks. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Barely broke a sweat. Those things are tough as they <laughs> barely Where broke a sweat. You mention it. How is it the hilly trails ended up here? These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's <clears> more <throat> normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. <laughs> Baton pass between characters. Yeah, true. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries. So the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. I did realize voice acting, uh, like the characters just stopped talking. Like they stopped, like her mouth stopped moving long before the dialogue finished. And that's, that's gonna be really distracting for me. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? It didn't happen with Paimon. It's happened with Amber a couple exactly. times. Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helps make the area a little bit safer. See? Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Yeah, it's a little. Them them lip flaps, bro. <laughs> True. All right. Anywho. <clears throat> Potato, carrots. Sounds like a good meal coming together. All right, I got the feather. I'll take that. Vaporizing. Vaporize itself does not inflict damage. However, the pyro and hydro attacks that triggers vapor deals increased damage. So it creates like steam almost. Nice. It's good to know. I guess that's why it, it told me because I was using fire arrows on the water. Hey, little Timmy's in the game. Because why not? <laughs> what are you doing? You're scaring the pigeons away. There's not much I care to do about it now. Uh, they'll be back. They do come back usually, but what happens if one day they leave and never come back again? Just... What the fuck, dude? That shit just took a turn. <laughs> oh my god. Little Timmy, I am so sorry. Why do you gotta do Little Timmy dirty like that? In every single story, in every single situation, Little Timmy gets screwed over. I was not expecting that at all. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, little kid. You know, I feel bad about those birds now. That was so unexpected. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna leave those birds. That's like the one thing that brings this boy true happiness in this world. Uh I swear to God, I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> Well, this is gonna be a fun game, I can already tell. Jesus, man, that is not fucking cool. That's so fucked up. Oh, boy. Well, I'm an asshole.
Interesting. I wonder if that god, that statue, is an actual person in the world. Let me officially introduce the city of wind, dandelions, and freedom. I'm a fan of dandelions. Travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Thank you, thank you. She looks like a bunny so much because of the the bow on her head. Like, she almost reminds me of Velvet. Finally, I don't know. No more having to camp outdoors. She's like a cross between like Velvet and Raven to me. Cause like she's got like the red aesthetic, but the, the bow on her head looks like rabbit ears. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by storm terror recently, but everything will turn out fine <clears throat> as long as Jean's with us. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. Jean, Defender of Mondstadt. Sounds like a swell guy. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious Storm Terror will be no match for us. Sounds like someone's pretty impressive. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Favonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. Oh, really? It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillitrol camp. Thank you. H hey, why doesn't Paimon get a reward? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Paimon. Oh, what is it? Is it a sword? But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy. Mm. Sticky honey roast. That sounds good. Sticky honey roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh, high ground. I don't think we're heading to the high ground. I think she just came up with something on the spot. <laughs> it's hard, too, because, like, I'm so used to... Uh... Oh, wait, I can climb the buildings. In... Wow. This used to be a bustling street, but with so many storm terror attacks recently, this is awkward. the usual crowds are nowhere They're probably like, what see. the fuck's this dumbass doing climbing Except buildings? Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there. They haven't been affected. If anything, their business is better than ever. Uh, it was a really great experience, especially when the DLC came out. Oh, there's a cat! You know what? This game's, it's just checking off all the boxes. It's like, we got cats, we got we got waifus, we have cats. Definitely game of the year contender. If if only they let you pet it, add in a patch to let us pet the cat. All right, let's, uh, let's see what's, what's the, what's the haps? What's going on? All right. So the present I want to give you is a wind glider. Oh, no wonder she wanted us to go on the high ground. So now we can jump off and use it. That's so clever. Outriders use them to ride the wind. Ride and the, people the wind, of Bullseye. Mondstadt love using them too. Nice. And we got the wind ability. I brought you here to give it to you so you can experience it right away. That's so smart. Amber, you're so considerate. I, I, I love this girl already. Oh, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? True. Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. Alrighty then, enough talk. <laughs> Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. Okay. Okay, move forward. Oh! <laughs> it's like mistakes were made. Press X to glide while airborne. Whoa! I got wings of freedom! Oh! Oh, are we gonna make this? Are we gonna make this? Are we gonna make this? Oh! Oh, snap! We can do this! Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Definitely outbeats a paraglider. I'll tell you that. Uh-oh. Too spooky. What the hell just the happened? Oh, is it that dragon again? Yep! We're back on that anime track, boys. <laughs> yeah, this dragon could level this whole fucking city. This is so sick, though. Look at this! I love how we're just casual as hell. This is badass, man. What the hell? Come on, Neko. Oh. oh, that's sick! We got the freaking wings now! Oh, please. Yo, Amber came in clutch for us. Holy shit. Wait, are we in a boss fight already? Oh, this is cool! Wow, this is cool. Holy shit, wait! Now, concentrate. 
Wait, who is this talking to me? Is it that, was it that kid that was talking to the dragon before? Holy shit, I'm busted right now. Oh, this is so awesome though. Oh, this is so sick. I'm actually fighting this dragon. Uh, Howling Hurricane of Modstad. I wonder if this is the physical representation. I'm also like shooting him in the ass. <laughs> This is so cool, though. The music is on point, man. Music's on point, I'll tell you that. So it's either the goddess itself, like the god, um, uh, Animo, is that, is that what it's called? It's either Animo or it's that one kid that was talking to the dragon earlier. But I'm just over here like, what is going on? This is too, this is hella anime. My God. That was pretty badass. I wonder if he was communicating through that crimson crystal that we picked up. Cause I was over here, I'm like, yo, am I going crazy right now? Like, what's in my head? <laughs> Modstad, a city of freedom that lies to the Northeast from the mountains, uh, open wide plains, the carefree breeze, scent of the dandelions, a gift of the animo God. Interesting. So what's up with this dragon? Why is it popping off? It's like angry. Oh. Meanwhile, uh, are you hurt? Yo, you came in clutch, man. It had you not given that. Whoa, who's this pretty boy? You've actually got the power to go up against the dragon. Who's are this? Are you a new ally or a new storm? <laughs> he just has like a no fucks given face. <laughs> Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Inch oh, so that's what she meant by Storm Terror, the dragon. I thought Storm Terror was like like this opposing army or something. Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time. Kaya? Must oh, she knows him. Okay. Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Yeah, pretty boy alert, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. Okay. I was like, who is this guy? Where'd he come from? These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? From afar. Uh, long story short. Uh, I helped her fight some, like, goblin monsters. I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. Cause, uh, that god waifu lady stole my sister. Oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. Hmm. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend <laughs> our thanks to you for your help just now. You're welcome. So, uh, where's the reward? <laughs> well, we can't just leave the situation to fester. Your fight to defend oh my the city God. against the dragon. There's some just savage now was by dialogue no small options. Number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters. Alright, nice. Not bad, not bad. 